Uganda are set to target of cultivating over a million acres of land with avocado trees within a period of five years as this African nation is pushing to become a global player in the growing billion dollar avocado industry. The global avocado market was valued at $14.85 billion in 2020 and is expected to expand by over 7% annually in the next seven years. I mean, this projected significant increment, authorities are now urging local farmers to grow more avocado crops. Let's have more details of that in this report. Uganda's new green gold, the Hass avocado. The low-hanging fruit is slowly attracting farmers' attention. It has a very good return uh, on investment. And it's a, it's, a, it's a crop that can easily be managed. And it has a, like a kilo of, of fruit can give you very good production. So when you look at it per acre, compared to other, to other crops, it has a very good production. Because of the high returns, more farmers are taking up avocado farming. <laughs> According to the country's National Agricultural Advisory Agency, more than five commercial farms have been established in the countryside since 2018. On average, each of these trees produces about 75 kilograms of avocado per season. But the owner of this farm says it's not enough to meet the growing demand for the green fruit on the market. He's now applying smart farming techniques to harvest more fruits for the export market. The global avocado market was valued at about $15 billion in 2022 and is expected to expand by 7.3% annually in the next seven years. In order to tap in this growing market, Uganda is encouraging more farmers to grow the crop. If we can be able to reach at least 500,000 farmers adopting this crop within a period of five years, with an acreage of at least a million acres of hass, for us, we would have hit our target within the five years. And then that can inform us on how do we move ahead. To achieve this target, the Uganda government is now subsidizing the cost of seedling. So we said, let us begin by making these seedlings or planting materials affordable to our farmers. So we came up with a strategy, of course, sharing with our farmers. We pay 70% of the cost of the seedling, and then the farmer pays 30%. Apart from marketing the fruit, entrepreneurs are also producing cooking oil and hair treatment products out of avocado. Currently, Kenya is Africa's largest producer, followed by South Africa and Tanzania. Uganda is aiming to compete with them by extracting as much value out of the fruit as possible. Hilara Yesga, CGTN, Mayuge, Eastern Uganda.